Listerella paradoxa is a slime mold species from the class Myxogastria and the only member of its genus as well as the family Listereliidae. The species is so far only found on the wattle genus Cladonia, mostly in European temperate zones. Characteristics the sporangia are just 0.1 to 0.3 mm large, visible to the unaided eye as mere black-brown dots. The dehiscence lines are slightly lighter and clearly visible. They are unstiped, more or less hemispheric and flattened on the edge. The single-layered peridium is tearing in four to six lobes during spore maturity and is purple-brown. It features dark lime tubercles only on the dehiscence lines, a capillidium is less developed and is composed of pale purple-brown, slim, vermiculated strands, which are overgrown on the peridia. On low magnification, the 1 to 1.5 micrometers thick strands look like string of pearls. On high magnification, there are from the center of the strand on cup or pear-shaped links visible, which thickenings are slightly darker on the blunted end, but the stipes are sallow. The link becomes gradually developed near the edge. The strand is first twice as thick as the normal dark-colored one, then constrictions appear on them. Then, the constrictions become apparent on them, which arrange it into light stipes and knots, become little by little slimmer and take the shape of a cup. Alternatively, the strand is lighter colored from the beginning on and the knots rapidly develop from the collar-like constrictions, the spores are black-brown as spore mass and in transmitted light brownish-yellow. They are on one side thin-walled, blur finely achondoid and have a diameter from 7 to 8 micrometers. Habitat Listerella paradoxa has been only found living on the thalli of the Cladonia species of lichen, Cladonia rangiferina, Cladonia impexa, Cladonia arbuscula, Cladonia gracilis, Cladonia tenuis, in temperate zones mainly in Europe, Germany, Sweden, Denmark, Great Britain, but also partially in Russia and Canada. A collection from California is classified as uncertain. Classification The species and genus were first described in 1906 by Eduard Adolf Wilhelm Jan on the basis of a discovery in Giesthacht. Its exact taxonomic position was unclear from the beginning and is still uncertain. Jan grouped it into a family because of its strands in the capillidium. In the first half of the 19th century however it was often grouped into the Dianmaceae, and at later times often into the Lysaceae because of the relationship. References <references>